All right. We have removed the old solar panel array. A pile of scrap wood over there we're going to throw out. It's junk. And uh, that used to hold a thousand water, which was uh, so neatly put up. So we got that little solar panel there, going to be taking that down and uh, probably taking that post out as well as the solar powered uh, water delivery system for our garden that didn't work out so well. Actually, it did, it's just not this year. Because we got this wonderful project 3,150 watts of solar panels. Going on these levels, it took us uh, only two and a half YouTube minutes to create for three days in real world time. Miter saw them, cut a 40 degree angle. Um, I used a solar calculator, said 30 degrees was the best for summer and 60 something was the best for uh, winter, so we went with uh, somewhere in the middle. Eight foot tall, this part here. Oh, well, you can see that. Let's see if we can get it all in. Eight foot tall there. This beam here is 12 foot at a 40 degree angle. And this here is a 9 foot beam on the base. So the way I join these together here was with some nice joiners. Uh, 90 degree angle, I used a square for that. And then I did that on both sides and uh, put as many screws in there, wood screws, as I could possibly get. And uh, these are 4 by 4s And uh, the ends I'm going to use hurricane strap on as soon as we get that. Or some kind of other joiner. Right now it's just got a big, huge bolt through the middle. Uh, a lag bolt. You can see that. We do have a sunlight. It's a nice lag bolt. A little bit of gap in there. You know, didn't cut it perfect. But uh, that's what the hurricane strap is going to do. And, uh, you know, a little hope and prayer. But these, uh, I've hung from these. And I could probably park my car on these. That's how strong they are. There's four of them. We're going to put these triangles up. Uh, there'll be a 25 foot space because, like I said, it's already 150 watts of solar panels. So these things are not tiny. They tower over me. So they might look small on YouTube, but they're definitely not. Uh, we're going to put uh, a 4x4 four four here at the 90 degree to connect these. Uh, there'll be four of them evenly spaced. And uh, I'm going to use, again, 4x4s four four to connect them. I'll use, uh, I'll connect the two of them here, the two of them there, and I'll connect those as pairs together, um, all with 4x4s. Four four and then along the top, which will be the front here, we're going to use super strut, and then we'll mount the panel to those. So we'll be able to expand if we want, or, uh, you know, even decrease in size. All we have to do is remove the super strut and the beam at the bottom, or add another triangle and we can expand it. Uh, four of these things will easily hold, uh, what, 50 pounds of solar panel, roughly. You know, there's 16 of them, so you can do the math. And that's that. We'll have another one coming when we got these all up and uh, get ready to mount the solar panels. All right, guys.